Hello, this is Allison from iSupWorld.com. We're going to take a quick look at the latest Honu Byron 10 foot 6 inch all rounder inflatable paddle board. I was excited to review this board because I had heard good things about it. Honu is an Australian brand that has been around since 2001 and has just recently started selling in the US as well. The Byron, named after the stunning Byron Bay in New South Wales, Australia, has a typical all-around shape and classic design, making it very versatile for paddling in different types of water. It can be used for cruising on calm water and is also great for tackling light surf. It is 10 feet 6 inches long by 32 inches wide, which is a very common size. However, it differs from many other boards on the market because it only has a thickness of 4.72 inches, as opposed to the standard 6 inch thick inflatable subs that we see so often these days. A 4.72 inch thick board has a couple of advantages. For one, it lowers the rider's center of gravity, allowing you to really feel the ebb and flow of the water and maneuver your board with it. Feeling this connection to the water can be really fun for a paddleboarder and create a very authentic experience. It is also easier to get back onto a 4.72 inch thick board if you fall in the water. Plus, it makes for a smaller and more compact package. The Byron has strong durable construction. Honu uses the latest cross-woven and fused PVC material when making their boards, so I don't feel that the rigidity is compromised even with the smaller thickness and it feels very solid. However, a rider over 225 pounds may prefer a larger 6 inch thick paddleboard. I really enjoyed paddling this board personally even in wind and chop and found it very responsive and quick to maneuver. It's compact, lightweight, easy to carry and with the rolling backpack is ideal for travel. If you're looking for ultra versatility, the Byron can handle most situations quite well. Included on the nose of the board is a front bungee system that can be used for storing a dry bag, water bottle or any gear you need to bring along for the ride and the bungees are easy to reach from the center of the board. Also included is a back bungee paddle holder that is ideal for securing your paddle when not in use so you can be hands free. There are three handles on the Byron, one padded center carry handle as well as two durable nylon grab handles, one at the nose and one at the tail. There are a total of nine D rings with two located at the tail, two are being used by the back bungee paddle holder, four are used by the front bungee system and there is one more located at the nose of the board. The Diamond Groove deck pad is comfortable and provides excellent grip. Plus, it's a good size for maneuvering your feet or just floating around chilling on the water. The triple bonded side rails help with the rigidity and keep the Byron strong and durable even in different situations. Also, a nice added feature is the back kicktail. The kicktail is perfect for foot placement for doing quick pivots and maneuvers. The Byron comes with a nice accessory package that includes a great backpack with wheels. The backpack zips open on three sides, making it very easy to remove the board and pack everything away after use. I also really love that Honu has included zipper pulls on this bag. It's not something I see often and really appreciate it as it makes it so much easier to zip and unzip the bag. The bag also includes two very durable padded carry handles as well as two integrated wheels so you can pull the bag easily to any destination. There is a front zippered pocket that can be used to store the fin and the leash, as well as a side paddle holder with cinch straps. The padded shoulder straps and chest strap can be adjusted for your size. All in all, it's a really nice backpack, a good size, and very functional. Also worth noting, the Byron only weighs 17 pounds, so it is extremely lightweight and portable. Carrying this board on your back is very doable if you need to hike a short distance to the water. Although I do wish the bag included a waist strap for added support, it's still fairly comfortable to carry. With the smaller size of this board, setup is quick and easy. It only took me just over six minutes to inflate the Byron to 15 PSI with the included GRI double action hand pump. The hand pump works well, has an ergonomic grip and attached pressure gauge so you can watch your progress. There is one removable nine inch center fin that greatly helps with tracking and stability. You'll definitely want to use the fin unless you are paddling in very shallow water. The fin is easy to install by twisting the little screw, so no tools are required. Also included in the package is a 10 foot coiled sub leash that secures to your ankle and the back D ring on the board. Use the leash at all times to keep your board close if you should fall in. Worth noting, the Honu boards do not include a paddle in the package. However, if you purchase a paddle at the same time as your board, you can get 20% off the paddle of your choice. And Honu has some really nice paddles available. 
Lastly, I think it's important to take note of the whole new 2 plus 2 year warranty, which basically means you get a standard 2 year warranty against manufacturer defects, plus Honu provides an extra 2 years on top of that of free repairs, which is an excellent guarantee. If you'd like even more information on the Honu 10 foot 6 inch Byron all-rounder inflatable stand-up paddleboard, head on over to my blog at www.isepworld.com where you'll find my detailed review and board comparisons. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for my latest reviews and videos. And if you found this review helpful, please click the thumbs up. I very much appreciate it. Thank you and happy paddling.